This is going to be a tough one for you. Do you believe in fairies? Why not? You know, if you're open to the spirit world and you're open to all sorts of things that take place that we can't see or is it normally, you know, human or animal? And um, we go, oh, no, that can't that can't be right. But um, I always remember my dad telling me to sit in front of this windmill because fairies will come out. And it was a good way of keeping me quiet. I'm not going to lie, because as a kid, I sat at that windmill waiting for those bloody fairies to come out. Um, I have seen what I thought were fireflies. And when I spoke to the local people in, um, where was I, St. Lucia? No, Grenada. And they said, fireflies aren't that colour. And I'm like, oh, bugger! Why didn't I film them? Um, and I think they were fairies because they were just glowing this like lovely blue-purple light. And I thought they were fireflies. Um, I've also um, shown you a photograph in one of my old videos of um, what looked like a dragonfly, but it wasn't there at all when I took the photo. I was taking the photo of a, a flower. So I'm going to show you something that's going to blow your mind. Okay, my friend Dawn, um, she is an amazing sound frequency healer. She's also a bloody magnet, and so is her house for spirit activity and elemental activity. Elementals are sprites of the land, if you like. Whether you believe it or not, I don't care. I do, because um, I've seen them. These can be um, like fairies. They can be little tinkery bits of light. They can be some people say that they see goblins and all sorts of things however have a look at this and tell me what you think now ordinarily i would say perhaps it's a butterfly but there's no fluttering if you know what i mean the movement isn't like an insect and then when we when dawn finally captures one of the fairies playing it literally is like the shape of tinkerbell long elongated wings and a, and a human figure it is mind-blowing so have a look at this footage and tell me what you think um she has had paranormal investigators um the geometric people go around she's literally sitting on a hub of energy that creates spirit phenomena and elemental phenomena and i'm going around to that garden and i'm going to sit there until i bloody see them next week i've been waiting for the good weather so have a look tell me what you think because I think this is absolutely mind-blowing. And if you've just come across this channel and me, know that I keep it real. There is no editing. There is no bullshit with me. I only show you what I know is real. And I absolutely mean that. So this isn't made up. It hasn't been doctored. My God, she don't even know how to do the text. So have a look and tell me what you think.
So what do you think? You know, I'm thinking dragonflies, it's not the season. Butterflies, it's still not the season. Um, Daddy long legs, not the season. So I don't know. But that last photograph, doesn't that look like just a Tinkerbell with two legs and two wings? If anybody's got any um, cameras or equipment, or well, not cameras, but any equipment that can zoom in and sharpen it, please do. Um, at the moment, I'm thinking fairies, but it could be debunked. I don't know. But, oh, my God, you can see them tumbling and playing with each other because a couple more turn up, don't they? And they even change colour. When they're swooping around, they change like an orangey-pink colour. So, anyway, let me know your thoughts. I'm open to a lot of things. I'm, you know, I'm kind of sceptical with some things, but this... I'm trying to debunk it, and I can't. I can't think what insect will create that. Let me know.